Good morning, staff and students. Hi, my name is Megan, and I'm coming to you live from the WLNK Studios. Today is Thursday, January 22nd, 2015. Elk Grove Village is expected to have a high of 35 and a low of 27 with partly cloudy skies. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Link Pride Pledge. I promise to respect myself and the rights and property of others. I alone am responsible for my actions and attitudes. I pledge to do my best at all times to be a positive role model. Our pledge people for today are... Mia, Rahil, Hovind, Mia. Birthday wishes go out to Elizabeth, room 204, Ashley, room 112, and Caden, room 209. Happy birthday! Second grade Battle of the Books will be meeting today in room 112 at your lunch recess. Third and fourth grade Battle of the Books will also be meeting at lunchtime in room 105. Bring your lunches. Coding Club will be meeting today after school from 3 to 4. Go to the library after the bell. Drama Club will be meeting today after school in room 110. Tomorrow is Spirit Day. Please wear Link Spirit Apparel or your favorite sports team. The classroom with the highest percentage will win a Link pennant. And now a word from Mr. McCauley. Good morning, Link Lions, and welcome to a very, very happy, excellent Thursday. It's great to see everybody this morning. This moment in history is something I'd like to tie into our goal this month of commitment. And actually, the moment in history is from two days ago. On January 20th, 1930, Apollo 11 astronaut Buzz Aldrin was born. Yes, the same Buzz Aldrin that the school in District 54 is named for. And if you can guess a few of the staff members in this school who actually attended that school, feel free to let us know. Buzz Aldrin was born in 1930. He was a decorated pilot in the Korean War and was one of the original Mercury astronauts. He earned his Ph.D. from Massachusetts Institute of Technology in 1963, and his nickname Buzz actually came from his little sister who couldn't say the word brother right. She used to call him Brother, and his family started calling him Buzz. Buzz Aldrin, I think, is one of the great examples of commitment because they were really going into uncharted territory with the moon landing, and he trusted everybody, he worked very hard, and he always expected success. So commit to success, and the sky's the limit. Have a great day, Lions, and be amazing. Thank you for tuning in for your morning news. Have a totally triumphant Thursday.